Hi everybody, today I'll be showing you how to make this cool bevel gear, gear train. It includes two bevel gears, which are gears that have slightly beveled edges so that they can make a 90 degree angle. It is a really good gear system that is used in a lot of machines so that you can transfer the energy on a 90 degree angle and turn it so that it can be directed somewhere else. So now let's begin. First we'll need to start off with the base. I have the base, the C plate, and the extender with the two black pieces attached on the third row on both sides. For more detail on how to make this you can watch our first video in the series, How to Make a Simple Gear Train. Next, you will need two axles, a few stoppers, a different kind of tighter silver stoppers, a crank, and two bevel gears. So now let's begin. Once you have this base ready, take out the longer of your axles and put a bevel gear through it, just like that. Then shove it through in there. But before we shove it through, add one of these metal fasteners at the end and using the screwdriver with the smaller end, tighten it. Now it should fit snug right inside. Like that. Next, let's take one of these stoppers and stop that just like that so now it doesn't have that much space to move and you can take two more of these stoppers put one anywhere you want put the crank through it and then put in a second one so now you can spin in your crank next let's turn this back around and add our second gear in our set of bevel gears. So this gear, I'm going to make it come out from the bottom so that it makes a 90 degree angle like that. So first, let's shove a really small axle to this one, maybe extend it a bit, and place it there. You can see they already almost Now we'll just need to tighten them a bit more. Taking one of these, place it over here in front, like that. Next, put that back here. But before you screw in the other side, put one of these in like that. And using the smaller screwdriver, Tighten it, and then place it inside. Now you can see it has an almost perfect fit. Almost. To solve this, just add one of these black pieces, like that, and test out what height works best to get the perfect bevel gear. So for me, I think this height works out and I'm going to use it. So on the back, you can see that I have way too much axle sticking out and mine won't be able to stand on the floor without it popping up a bit. To solve this, what I'm going to do is 
just loosen that a bit and push everything up. Like that. Now we can retighten it. Like so. Put it back in the hole. And on the other side, we can now see that it's a lot shorter. And using our last stopper, we can put that there. And now we can see that we have two bevel gears with the 90 degree angle. So now, let's give this a spin. I'm going to zoom in. A bit more so that you can see exactly how these two bevel gears spin. You can see when I spin the crank the second bevel gear moves along with it. You can also notice that if I spin this here the first gear also moves. Thank you for watching!